Hi there, Release Fire here again with more from Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl and this time I'm going to talk you through how to get to Spear Pillar. Now obviously there are conditions to get there and I'll cover those in a little bit but to get to Spear Pillar you need to head west from Heart Home City on Route 208 and then you're going to go north through Coronet Mountain so head left and head up these stairs and then you're going to want to head down here and over the bridge over on the left hand side keep heading over and then into this tunnel and then you're going to head up and around here and to the left up these stairs over to the left and down again through this little weird little bit here to the left where it's really difficult to get through and then up and around here and then you're looking to head right across the water. Now you're going to need the move surf to be able to get over here so if you don't know the move surf you can check out the video linked above to see what you need to do to get that and then edge slowly around this corner so you don't just jump off and then you can climb up this wall using the rock climb move Again, if you haven't got that yet, you can check that out in the video linked above. Continue up the stairs and you'll come to a little section where there are a few pickups to get. But in all reality, the whole area of Coronet Mountain, there's so many things you can find and I'm not going to cover all of them. But I did talk a little bit earlier about the conditions you need to meet to be able to get up to Coronet Mountain and the reality is that you're not going to unlock everything to be able to get up here including things like the rock climb move until you complete the seventh gym which is Snow Point City and if you don't know how to get to Snow Point City again you can see that in the video linked above. Now continue on across over this bridge and then wind your way around to go underneath the bridge and then up this set of stairs and through this exit here and you'll find yourself with some stairs. You can go up these ones, up these ones and then you want to go up here and you'll have a little battle to face. Now you can go down for more pickups and more exploration but the reality is you need to follow it around and outside into this snowy section on the mountain. Head up the stairs and around this corner and you'll come to this rock climb Get on up to the top and then you want to head left and then through this section of long grass through the door here and that will bring you back inside and then head up with a little bit more rock climb all the way up to the top and then you want to get into another fight with the grunt, get past them and another one just around the corner and you'll come down these stairs. Follow it over to the right hand side and head outside and then you want to head on around here down these stairs over here and then you want to take the rock climb on the left which is the way to get to the top two spear pillar and then head left down the stairs push this boulder out of the way using strength and then you need to head on over to the right, head down again and then head on over to the left. Now there's a big mushroom on the platform below but I'm not covering that here. Head back up and around and through this entrance and then it's just a case of following it all the way up to the top taking out all of the grunts on the way. If you keep doing that over and over again that will slowly work your way up to the very summit to Spear Pillar and that is how to get to Spear Pillar in Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Like I said earlier if that helps you out drop me a like, leave a comment, subscribe with the link on the left hand side and you can see more of my guide videos for Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl with the links on the right hand side.